So I hope you guys can see me. Uh, welcome back to another episode of KK Outdoors. Today I am in Chamberlain, South Dakota. I know I didn't film anything for getting out here. Uh, I, I'm starting to try something new, so if you guys can't even see me, it's controller error and everything like that. But um, I, I brought a travel rod along Fenwick. Uh, I'd like, I'd, I'm trying to get to build one from Big Bear, which would be really sweet. Um, uh, quick sellout moment, like this video, subscribe, make sure you watch it, uh, I, I see a lot, I can see how long you guys are actually watching, and the watch time is not very good, neither is the subscriber count, guys, I mean, I'm ready to do another giveaway, I'm waiting on you guys, I have everything, this, I'm ready to do a giveaway, if we can hit 200 subscribers, if we can get that, giveaways on me. All day. Alright? Um, but no, today I'm just going to be filming a lot of the tournament stuff. Maybe use some of the footage off of Brock's, Brock Dufresne's uh, drone, which would be sweet. And uh, yeah, it's, it's kind of rainy, so uh, I'm not going to get into a lot of that. But I'm also going to be fishing for bass in Chamberlain, South Dakota. Who would have thought, right? But yeah, I'm chilling out the camper, and uh, yep, I'll just tell you guys when we're there. Chicken. Hey, what's going on guys? Um, so, just come back into it. We are going, I'm going to show you guys some content from that tournament. And uh, also, I'm going to show you a little bit of bass fishing. Uh, there's The weather has been changing. I don't expect it to be good. But uh, yeah, so we're going to go tournament, bass fishing, and then we'll end it. So, you know what to do. We have team number 46, Aaron Wallaber and Dwayne Wallaber. Come on up to the scale. You got a five fish limit. I hear you got a hog in there. Two nice ones, two really nice ones. Let's pull out that over. Look at that Missouri River walleye right there. Whoa. That's mine actually. That fish is going to go 686. That's big fish in the tournament so far. Why don't you take this mic and tell us a little bit about how you did it today? Uh, well, this morning it was tough. The rain, uh, clouds, wind, and really nothing going on. Just stuck in our spot. Uh, about 1.30 it turned on and, and uh, two passes and you got a fit. Nice. Well, let's see what we got for total weight today. Whoa. Here we go. 18.17. That'll put you in first place, guys. Thank so you, far. Guys. Thank you. Why don't you come over here and we'll get you a printout and uh, we'll send you back with those fish. Boat number 14, Mike Van Iperen and Jay Breeze. Three fish in there. Number 13, Shane Kendall and Neil Jensen, Team Warrior. <laughs> Looks like they have a four fish bag. We're doing good. How, how are you guys doing today? Did okay. Yeah, we're one fish short. Uh, 
pitch jigs all day up in the dam, up in the Stilla Basin. Um, we're just one fish short. Rolled the last fish with five minutes to go. So, had a great day. It helps taking every last minute. 319 on the big fish. We're going to get a total of 862 today. 862, that's not a bad start for first tournament of the year. For the weather, again. Lovely weather. Stay dry today, that was good. Quickly, what I have been told is uh, that there are bass down here on this little dock. Not a little dock, it's a bigger dock. And he said to go right here and just start flipping. He said you're gonna you're gonna be catching some. So I got the travel rod. We're gonna see what we can do. So. There we go. <laughs> wow. That's how it's done right there, guys. Wow. Wow. That is, oh my gosh. Guys, it's, that's a nice little bass right there. Wow, nice fish. Uh, caught that on the craw uh, jig, uh, brown finesse jig, casting up by this post. But uh, yeah, nice. He almost looks like a spotted bass. Really, 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 really nice colors on him. If you can see him. But uh, yep, gonna let him go, and I'm gonna keep it, keep her up. So see you, bud. So ending off today's video, guys. Um, I went fishing in Chamberlain, South Dakota. I got a little bit of stuff from the tournament, which was really great. I even got my dad in there and Mike Van Ibrin, some of these guys in there that I thought was really, really neat. And, uh, yep, this is out in Chamberlain, South Dakota. The weather, on the other hand, was not too favorable. The, it went from uh, sunny to rainy and just kind of cloudy, murky weather all day. And that was yesterday. And uh, it, it really shut the fish off and a lot of people struggled in the tournament but uh, some people did really 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 good uh, the winner had about 18 pounds worth of walleye and five fish I believe which is insane that is a massive amount of fish um, but yeah when I went I just went around the dock and, and uh, I just flipping this around on a jig and it, it really worked well uh, fishing really slow you can't really do very much fast wise but yep that's how the video went. Uh, one fish only only was down there for like five minutes, so I really didn't have time to work, 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 and try to figure all that stuff out. 
Weather out here is crazy. It's snowing. But yep. Last thing, uh, subscribe. And uh, I really, I really want to do this giveaway for you guys because I, I do know there are a few people out there who may be watching who don't really have the stuff to go bass fishing. And uh, it's really going to be just a great starter box for someone who, who doesn't doesn't really have anything to do stuff with. I'm going to be giving away like a rod and a tackle box and stuff like that. And I might, if I can get Big Bear to contribute, which they probably will, um, I'll get them to do a giveaway something, maybe another gift card. Um, but, yep, uh, thank you for watching this video. If you made it this far, hit the like button down below. Uh, comment what you want me to do next. I'm, I'm really about out of ideas. Uh, lake's open in Spirit Lake. So, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and uh, see you in the next video.